Hello everyone. This is Sh 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 Shobhit, and this is Core Task 14. In this, a uh, a uh, a, uh, I will be explaining the this painting, which is called the Death of Sir. Sir Socrates. This painting was k k created by de <coughs> de uh, David, French painter Jacques Louis David, in seventeen eighty seven. Let's start. First, I would be telling you just to notice positions of each character. How are they? If you see this section of uh, E. If you see right side of the painting, people have curved back. Most of them are little bent over. If you see le le left side, you see characters who are ha ha hiding their faces and then in the middle we have a, 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 one person who is sitting erect he is not ha, hunched over or something and then you see in the end few people waving goodbye or leaving once you have noticed all this now let's think this is the moment where we have have to think when does a Pa, pa, person has curved back or he is hunched over when he is when he is very sad or tired or exhausted when does a person hides his face when he a, 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 is ashamed so it sends the message that they are exhausted tired and sad he is ashamed if you see his Ka, ka, cup. He is holding the poison that Socrates was going to drink. Socrates, even in his la la last moment, is sitting erect, though he has been shown a little more muscular than he would have been but yeah he is sitting erect he is not afraid he is ready to take the poison he is <clears throat> not 
exhausted like others or sad like his family that is leaving from behind or ashamed like the person who a a is giving him the cup this guy he is sitting at the end of the bed where socrates has his legs this according to me indicates that he is disciple of socrates not disciple but the one who carries someone's legacy so they are sitting in a row he and then this so he is actually pl- pa- pa- plato who was a disciple of socrates did you i think i now you have a better understanding of what is going in the picture also notice the behind wall is a little drab then this this is a this section of the picture is more lively than the behind other thing that you can also notice is these little signs here and here i don't know if i can zoom it okay i can zoom it this is not visible okay this okay here actually david has put his sign here and here maybe he was indicating that he is a disciple of plato and he is among this section of people as well he wanted to be in both sides thank you